Hello again, YouTubers, I'm Spongebob11 back here again on the Spongebob channel with part 11 of our Spongebob Patty Pursuit playthrough video series. If you missed out parts 1 through 10, link to the playlist is in the iCards as well as in the description box below. So, um, yes, we do have some treasure to open up actually because I, uh, went, well, went through the uh, level 7.1 again uh, to collect the last few coins and I'm gonna run the clip uh, very soon but just um, let's just collect these so we've got 900 coins in total here uh, to put towards our rewards which actually gives us a new map piece all right so um, we still have a lot of rewards to go so uh, without further ado I'm gonna run the clip of don't worry, folks. The Krusty Krab will be open again yeah, soon. Yeah, uh, run a clip of low 7.1831 bottom feeder lane, and I'll show you guys exactly where the last few coins, the six coins that we were missing, are at. What just happened? Alright, so that was that. Now let's begin with the video's content proper, 7.3 Glove World After Hours. Let's go! Here we go. So, um, yeah, uh, obviously this level features Glove World, so great to be back. Whoa, we are in a cave. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead with Patrick for now. And uh, from now on, I'm always gonna just check on the left side before we, you know, move on. Whoa, okay, so we're just gonna have to get up there and into the cannon. We did miss um, some... Yeah, we, we need to get the map piece first, so let's get that. Okay, so map piece collected. And then we also have this, um, the coin. We have one more coin, so I think I should probably get that before we move on. There we go. So you yeah. collect it. Now let's proceed. Um, there is a treasure chest there as well. So let's open that and then back up here. So yeah, um, this is a glove world. Well, underneath glove world. Okay, so here uh, there is a treasure chest up there. So let's unlock that. Get rid of this clown here, and then I need to get rid of the one on the bottom as well. Okay, so now we have access to Patrick again, um, and what we are going to do is get in this cannonball here. Oh, alright, so that church chest was supposed to be unlocked via cannonball. And yes, finally we are up in Glove World surface level. Okay, so checkpoint. Now, um, first up, let's go to the left side here. We have a whole bunch of coins as well as a cannon. So I'm gonna collect all the coins here. Um, and this is a little bit tricky because um, the platforms will be breaking. So just watch out for that, I guess. And then once you go through here, there we go. Hold on to the anchor and darn, we missed one. Okay, so we gotta get that last coin before moving on. There we go. Okay, hop over here. Let's go through here. Gotta hang on to that. And into the cannon. There's also fireworks in the background, which is super awesome. There we go, got into the cannon, and now head over this way, onto the right side. Whoa, <laughs> great. And also we've got the fiery Festo pain car over here. Okay, so we've got some urchins up there, so that's not the correct way. So now, smash through here. And we've got another swingy thing. Okay, that was a really close one. There we go. Yippee! 
Okay, jump through the hoop and get into the cannons. So over here, there's the attraction glove drop. You can see the mitten in the background as well. Really nice. Okay, so I realized the trick to this is that you just don't touch it. So you just let let SpongeBob hook onto the thingy there, and then it just works. If you touch it, you you'll just well fail and fall into the urchin pit. Okay, so there you go. Yeah, we got all the coins, we got all the map pieces, and this is level complete. Awesome! Young Collector, you have earned every spatula in this level. So the status is awesome. Amazing, actually. Great. New high score. Okay, so that was level 7.3 in Glove World. Now, um, level 7.4 should bring us to rock bottom, so that's Don't worry, folks. The crusty crab will be open again pretty soon. exciting, I, I would say. <laughs> um, some of you actually have asked before, like, what is my favorite SpongeBob episode? Honestly, I don't have a favorite, but I do have a favorite from every uh, season, Here we go. and especially for season one, uh, that episode is rock bottom. Probably just because... Um, it's like a new location, oh and it's a very weird one, to say the least. Okay, so here we are in Rock Bottom. Um, I think we can just proceed with Patrick, so... Yeah, oh, we have Gary right here. So, the thing about these levels is that, um, they do provide the characters that you need. So, if you, you kind of exactly choose, um... You can't exactly choose uh, the characters you want. Well, I, I do want to get the coin. There we go. Okay, so we're going up here. And then we've got more coins on this wall. Why is the sky in the rock bottom, like, orangey? Is it sunset or something? Okay, we got the coin anyways. And we've got the bus! Oh, man! I mean, if Spongebob wanted to, he could just get on the bus right now. Then we can stop playing this level. <laughs> right. Okay, so um, we've got the bus there, and there are two levels to this. I think I'm actually just going to go on the first one. First. Okay. So now that we're a jellyfish, uh, we can actually go over here. Um... Slowly descend. Man, these um, these coins over here are tough to get. There we go. Okay, so we've got the coins. Now let's get out of here. Going through this doesn't do anything. We gotta get go through the exit gateway. There we go. Okay, and now uh, we can front of front back. I would say. Get this last map piece over here. And then I'm gonna go over this way and then back down. I don't really remember this um, soundtrack actually playing in the original rock bottom. I just it's, it's always possible that I'm just I just haven't played this game for so long. Alright, so we've got one more map piece to get here and uh, first up we need to go backwards down the slope again and then as you can see here we have this little lava cavern of sorts where we can get the last one all right so that's gonna get us the remainder of the coins as well and one thing I realize is that you really sh you really don't have to tap at all when Okay, uh, uh, fainted again, and so now, let's finish up this level here. Turns out that, you know, when you're swinging, you don't actually have to um, tap to move. You will move automatically, so that's, in a sense, great. Oh, wow, okay, so we've got a whole bunch of coins there, and I think we need Sandy to get to it, so let's first go down here. We've got a treasure chest. A um, couple more coins there. Back onto the anchor. Okay, then this way we need to go down. Oh, okay, so yeah, Sandy's right there, so great. 
So Sandy will allow us to get through the beanbags. And then of course over here, over here. Oh yes, okay, so first we need to go backwards now. So I'm gonna collect them all. Avoiding the jellyfish. And then, okay, now we can go um, to the right here. And... Yeah, so we can actually collect all the coins from this area. I'm not sure if we are actually supposed to be doing this, but I mean, it seems like it because there aren't that many platforms that Squidward can create. So I would assume that would be the case. Alright, so back down here. Yeah, okay, so now we've got Squidward. I'm gonna go read a magazine. So going up again, now Squidward can create the platforms um, of jellyfish, which we will be able to get to this platform from, and then time to smash down. Gotta remind myself every single time not to <laughs> uh, tat when we're swinging. Okay, so I'm just gonna wait for the angler fish to go away. And we can smash down here, and this will bring us back into the- whoa, whoa, let's get out of here. Oh darn, more angler fish. Oh, we got a chest too. And I don't think we got all the coins though. We got all the map pieces, that's for sure. Oh, we got all the coins! Awesome! No, amazing! Alright, so uh, yeah, I think that's where we'll leave it today. Make sure to subscribe, like, favorite, comment, etc. Keep right here on Anonymous Bunch of 101. Don't worry, folks. The Krusty Krab will be open again soon. Oh, we got extra coins too. Great. And the next level is... 7.5, Ghost Host, named after the episode, Ghost Host, right? So uh, before we end off, I do want to collect the uh, final map piece from the rewards here. Or it's not a final one, but we got another one, I, I guess. Uh, we've got some more missions. No, we don't have any more missions for now. But yeah, so anyways, that's all for this video. I'll see you guys in the next SpongeBob video. Bye!